Kernahan, it's having a fair start. Short, beautiful pass, great football, Carlton. Oh, how's this side looking? Well, I wonder if uh, Kevin Sheedy's sitting back watching this as well. The ball, play on, said the umpire, as the ball is brought by Blackwell up towards half forward. Kenny is leading beautifully up there at full forward, Peter Kenny. He's got a loose man. And up high. <laughs> Peter Rowe. High, the forward line, one grab. Can't complete it, Kenny. Snares it now. Beautiful handball to Ashman. He dummied in wonderful style, and Ashman has goal. Thank you to Peter Kenny, because that's who the goal belongs to. 12-5-5, Carlton plays Hawthorne 4 5 We're seeing the same token, he's been forced to struggle very hard for any kick he can. Short pass to Peter Kenny. He's moved around well since coming on as interchange. He has gone to full forward. He's been covering a ton of territory right across the forward line. He's yet to score a goal himself, but he's been responsible for a couple of others. He's directly in front, Pete. 30 metres out. And favouring a drop puck. Has a good look. It says it'll do. And so Carlton go to a six point lead. Six seven plays five seven on seven. Big lead. Well, that was great play by Mark McClure because uh, he looked down at the goal square. He saw that the only players down. It's on as Hunter goes up towards the forward line and Peter Kenny. Jason Dunstall is off the ground. A short pass. It's effective. Wayne Blackwell. That's a tribute to one in particular, Robertson, a quick kick down to full forward position. Leading there is Kenny, and Kenny stuck it off the ground. Well done, Peter Kenny. As he registers Carlton's first goal. Carlton, however, trailing Richmond. Richmond, two straight goals, 12. Carlton, 1-1, one, one, 7. Not looking for anyone in particular as Blackwell gets the ball, a high ball looking down forward to... And nicely done, Peter Kenny. Peter Kenny flew over the back of Kernahan and has taken a good mark. Could be a bit of a worry to Michael Lockman. Lockman not noted for his speed. Got a ton of courage and aggression. Don, do you think the wind could be upsetting Justin Madden today? The no, connection? not at all, Ray. Not at all. He has not taken a clean grab at this stage. As Kenny lines up for Carlton's seventh goal, and he's made no mistakes. He's across to Shane Robinson. In turn, well picked up, Bradley. Bradley across to Kenny. Kenny only 30 metres out. And he slams another through. So As um, Peter McCormick do uh, send the ball out to the half-back line. Smith, Dean, oh, oh. very strong mark from Peter Kenny. Uh, Kenny, once again. Robinson, Robinson clear on the wing, looking for his uh, teammate and Bradley Shine, and Shine has taken the mark, and you'll have to give that 15 yards, umpire. Uh, against uh, Michael Roberts, I think it is, Don. Uh, good play there, Don. Is that, uh... Well, not really, and uh, Shine plays on quickly into the forward part. High is Kernahan. They're looking for him every time. He ends. Kenny, well done, Peter Kenny. They look for Kernahan each time they go forward. If he doesn't take the mark, it comes to the ground. And Kenny, using his speed there, swooped on the ball, and he's kicked. Hits. Williams, thanks, uh, Greg. So uh, it goes across to the half forward line and the Saints try to clear it out. It's coming through for the, for the Blues is Shine. Uh, once again, still scrambly. Picked up by Kenny. Kenny has a shot for goal. And I think you'll find that'll be a goal to Peter Kenny. And the first blood to the Blues. Uh, cut down to the half forward line and the Blues into attack once again. Oh, Kernahan couldn't favour it. Coming in as Blackwell. He can't machine. He's in front of him. But diving through, picking it up as Kenny. And Kenny's put a goal through for the Blues. Great goal, Peter Kenny. Goes to Road, who balks brilliantly. Goes to centre half forward. Johnston, but a good mark in front taken by Kenny. Plays on quickly to the forward pocket area. Kernahan from behind, Ashman at ground level to McClure, looking for his third. Threads through the hand pass delightfully, and the goal is kicked by Williams. It's Kenny. Kenny. Paul Camillus. Tom Alvin. Oh, Kenny. Second bite, good attempt. Maybe he was lucky to get in there, but he went with it with everything that he had and all the courage and all the endeavour. He really sprayed it and then caught it on the way down.
He's got to kick this. The Blues leading by eight, uh, eight points to Essendon zero. And Kenny, a chance to give them another goal. He'll have to kick this. He couldn't miss. It's his first goal. 15-minute mark. First quarter at Essendon have not so far in the season. Simon's a slow starter, but Justin's an earlier starter this year. Oh, Kenny! Oh, he should have taken it. What a lovely leap. Free <laughs> kick against Trench now. <laughs> he shoved him out of the way. Up it goes, and a good mark taken down. Kenny once again, my word. It didn't take him long. He kicked the first goal in the first minute of the final term. So he's, he's taken his second mark. He's having his second kick, or can he kick his second goal? Because he's inside the distance, Pete, he kicked that other one. That's so. right, it was certainly a longer kick. He's going to drop punt though this time. He didn't do it badly, did he? Have a look at that. It's another one. Two marks, two kicks, two goals. I think I'd go off if I was in. A star again. He's had a great year up to... Oh, Peter Kenny is on the ground. I thought he was still on interchange, but he, he would have been sitting there itching to get onto the ground to get a part of this action. Well, it didn't take him long to get into the action, Peter, no. because that's his first... He just come on at three-quarter time. That's his first kick, first mark, first kick. So let's see if he can kick a goal first up. He's out 50 metres, and we'll take the shot. McClure leading away from goal, but McKenney's going to have a go himself. A torpedo punt kick. My word, that's a good-looking kick. That's a beautiful goal. You can't do much. Shelter from the stand. They're all up. Who's waiting down? Lyle goes in. The handball comes out. Evans has it. Goes on to the short to Kenny and he takes it. Good little left foot chip to Peter Kenny who let out well and he'll have a shot. Carlton forwards doing very well at present. Getting away from their opponents by getting in front and taking that first couple of metres start and they're very hard to peg back from there. Kenny did so well against Melbourne a few weeks ago. Putting the ball to boot, he kicks very well, this fellow. That's no league, exactly plays on from the back pocket position. And we're into time on, Jack, in this first term. Madden over the top. Now, that's just doing it too easily. That is doing it far too easily. Kenny has won. And no checking there at all. He's about 45 metres out. Seven points is the margin at the moment. It's a fair kick from Peter Kenny. It's a great kick. 13 points is the margin on sevens. Big lead. Well, having seen the kick, to Reese Jones, he gets around on the left foot, looks for Kernahan. He goes up high. No, it's uh, not Kernahan who was looking for at all. It was uh, Kenny. Kenny. Kenny came out in front of Ian Law and now will go for his third goal. He's only 25 metres out from goal. As I said in the first term, Carlton seemed to be able to get their goals much easier than North Melbourne. North get it down there and struggle for a, a goal. Occasionally, Carlton get it forward and seem to be, to be able to convert very easily. So Kenny going for his third goal. A good kick too, he is. Yes, no exception. That's his third goal. So through Kenny, Carlton get it. Too high, I would have thought Alvin's kick up towards half forward. Kenny. He's right on the 50 metre line, or he will be when he takes the kick. Bankman and Curta had in the square. And obviously pretty confident that he can get this kick. He certainly should be able to just about get the distance. Kenny, 50 metres out. That's a goal. Carlton lead by six points. Kenny's first. Three count looking a lot better now as Robertson hooks the ball back. And there's a good mark taken by Kenny. And he's well within kicking distance, about uh, 35 to 40 metres out from goal directly in front. Well inside the 50 metre mark on their attacking zone. That's a great mark to Kenny. Bradley over it comes to Melbourne, tries to find Blackwell. He's in trouble, knocked out by Fairley. Kenny's grabbed out, it goes to Blackwell again. A hand pass to Evans, running to an open goal. Myers. And that's another one for Carlton, so they're back in front again. That's it. Back it comes to Blackwell. Out to Kenny. Kernahan in the forward pocket. Carlton doing as they like virtually. Kernahan shoots a goal and puts it through for another one. And so that makes the difference now. Seven goals at the MCG, and that one for Blackwell. Blackwell up towards the centre half forward position, and in fact over that location. Picked up by Glasgow. Lovely ball. Glasgow dummies again. Tried to be a little bit too flash, actually. Murphy, Lascott, can he make a man? It is a goal coming up. Kenny, a metre out, and 
he pops it through for another one to Carlton. That's his first goal. 11 Carlton players have now scored goals. That's got in a little bit of trouble. 18-11, 1-1-9 to 5-9, 39 at the MCG. It's around Foster. He had his number taken earlier. He'll be fronting up to uh, the Peter Doddick and show it. VFL House on Monday night. That's not a mark. 